you guys and girls in the illumination. Time to jump aboard the loon train. It's me, it's me, it's JJD, JJ Double J, the Illuminator here, also known by almost countless other aliases and nicknames. But we won't get into that right now. Today is, what's today? Tuesday, October 16th, 2018. And today I want to talk about something called Craigslist. Now, Craigslist, from what I can understand, and I've never used it before, but Craigslist is something like eBay, where you have something to sell, you put it online, but it's more for, like, oops, my little tower of power over here almost fell down, my <laughs> lunch bags for work, my uh, coolers almost fell onto the ground, <laughs> all of them. Anyway, uh, that's what that noise was. Uh, eBay is more for shipping all over the world, and I think Craigslist, from what I can understand, is probably more like you look for things that are in your own area of the country, your own town, your own neighborhood, people that want to sell sometimes bigger things like picnic tables or, I don't know, big gas grills or whatever. I mean, not that you can't sell that stuff on eBay, but it's more like you, you find something and you go and pick it up from somebody instead of having it shipped to you. Sometimes it's used for things like animals to rehome kittens or dogs or whatever, but my question is, has anyone ever used Craigslist? Um, is it safe? Is it something that is... Uh, worthwhile doing if you have stuff to sell. Um, I don't know. I mean, I, I got a whole bunch of junk, and you know, sometimes they say one is man, one man's trash is another man's treasure. So instead of throwing away, sometimes it's easier to sell. But I mean, are there fees involved? I don't know. Just something I figured I'd ask. It's been on my mind, and um, I know a coworker that I've asked, and she said that she sold things on Craigslist, but she doesn't want people to come to her house. Understandably. So she always meets like in the store parking lot, like a Walmart or a Target parking lot. And um, and I un totally understand that type of thing. She sells like a lot of bigger things sometimes, like patio sets and stuff and all that sort of jazz. But I figured I would ask, has anyone uh, had any good or bad experiences on Craigslist? Let me know. Uh, I'd appreciate it. Um, and that's about it. So uh, I love you all. Take care. Have a great rest of the day. Be good to yourself. And remember... If at all possible, try to organize your life because no one else is going to do it for you. This is the Illuminator, and I'll be back.